vapor the cooling of vapor is condensation so the vapor that is the steam the steam becomes small droplets of water and it becomes heavy when it becomes heavy it becomes heavy as it becomes cool it becomes heavy when it becomes heavy it dries and drops on the ground and the water again comes back on the same on the same land as see this is the rainfall this is the cloud this is the sun this is the vapor which is going up it is the heat of the sun and the heat of the sun is coming down and the water is evaporated and condensation vapor condensation all this takes place when condensation takes place the water droplets becomes heavier and it drops as rain this is rain and this rain water seeps inside the ground this rain water seeps inside the ground inside the ground and become ground water which we use so remember children this is the basic thing which we will learn in the chapter that is how the water gets into the earth and how we use the ground water because only 1% of ground water is usable only 1% of the ground water is usable the total water is 100% 100% water is there but only use is 1% only use is 1% we use only 1% so now let us go to the third one so we have learned to one word aquaculture that is the farming and the fishing which is carried on in the aquatic areas that is sea pond and lakes and the second is how water seeps into the ground now let us come to the next part of the chapter first let me tell you that 100% water is there glacier that means ice sea water that means salt ground water saving water is very very important now we come to the next part of the chapter where we will see how what are the uses of water now we will see what are the uses of water now when we are talking about the uses of water we will see 
that we in the morning when we get up we tell our mother put my paste into my brush so that I can brush my teeth and use the water to wash my face. Secondly, your mother tell you to go for your bath and you go to the bathroom to take shower. You have your milk, you have your breakfast and then you drink water and without and without any reason we also use water. We, we drink water. And, second, and fourthly, the picture which is showing that your mother is washing clothes. Every day these works are done. Every day these works are done. Now, when every day these works are done, so we can also show you that how every day the fields are also the fields are also watered by water. The fields are also watered by the water. And it also comes from the ground.